I got a 2015 Volkswagen Amarok customer complaint is that he sensed that the vehicle is losing power and he's not sure why. So let's put the scan to it and see what's going on. So I got a P22D500 code which is a turbocharger problem. So let's put the vacuum gauge on it and see what's going on. Alright, so I'm not developing much vacuum at all, right? So if I'm suffering from vacuum, that means the turbo actuator can't get what it needs to actuate, right? So well, what I'm seeing here, the actuator shaft is moving, as you can see. But for some reason, we have a performance code, right? I don't believe that we have a circuit problem, like something's wrong with the actuator. So I believe I found the fault. So basically, we're losing vacuum between the master cylinder and the booster, right? It has an O-ring behind it. I'm not sure if the O-ring is damaged, but we're definitely losing vacuum right here, right? So what we got to do is remove that master cylinder and replace that O-ring. But yeah, definitely have a fault right there. Yeah, so the gap is really huge too. I'm not sure who was here before, but it looks like they didn't replace the master cylinder back where it's supposed to. So I'm gonna remove it and replace that O-ring behind the master cylinder and, you know, seal it back up and that should be it, right? So, so if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. I know it's real quick, straight to the point. And I believe we're definitely going to fix this turbo problem with this P22D500 fault once we get sufficient vacuum going to the turbo, right? So, yep, somebody definitely was here. You can see, like, they basically made an a imprint on the booster, so that was leaking. I mean, it could be corrosion. And you see right now, we gain everything working like it's supposed to. All right, so stay tuned for more videos by DJ Mobile Auto Services. Until next time, peace.